Namaste friends and we are at the last um, Rasi in the Rasi series it's called the Meena Meena or the Pisces sign uh, its complexion is blue it is footless and has a medium build it rises with both head and tail and is strong at night it rules the north and resorts to watery places it is a watery sign and has a sattvic temperament these temperaments are gunas which we have uh, rajasic, tamasic and sattvic uh, it is a feminine and belongs to a Brahmin caste. It's kind of caste uh, is this Brahmin, Sudra, Kshatriya, and these castes has nothing to do with the Indian uh, caste that we see predominantly. Uh, but this has uh, categories uh, in Vedic astrology. Uh, it is a human Rasi and is ruled by Brahaspati himself or Jupiter. People who are born under the graces uh, of Meena Lagna are sensitive, honest, and highly compassionate. Okay, they love the arts and spiritually oriented. Highly imaginative uh, individuals, they have good sense of intuition and emotional, meaning that they would know things before it happens up front. They sort of uh, natural psychic abilities. Okay? Um, they find it difficult to express themselves clearly and is sometimes moody right? and uh, withdrawn. With if if Guru or Jupiter is not favorably positioned, these people will become moody and um, uncertain. Right? Their actions can be very fickle. All right. Um, so the bo those born also uh, they have very, have very short temperament. Uh, they uh, they are very um, they are very particular in their job. Meticulous uh, would say also. Um, According to classical texts, those who were born under this lagna are endowed with uh, precious stones and goals. They are very cautious and um, they are also very wise. This is according to classical texts. And uh, yeah, so that's about the Meena Rasi. So that completes the 12 Rasis in a very uh, cursory look. I would try to cover in depth each and every Rasi uh, in future videos. But to get a, a very base, a very a cursory understanding on what um, Rasis are, uh, these uh, videos, these 12 videos would give you a general idea. But um, I would definitely go in depth on why, like things like temperament, it's, uh, you know, rising from the head, rising from the feet, strong at day, strong at night, all these attributes um, are very important when you do predictions. Okay, so with that said, uh, thank you so much and I hope to see you in other videos. Namaste.